Hey guys, it's Kaylor. Welcome to the YouTube channel. Today is day 34 of the Daily UI and we're making a car interface today. So I started off with an image that I found on Google of a 350Z and I just cropped out the gauges there and I went back and forth between Photoshop and Illustrator creating elements and kind of aligning them as I needed uh, for the design. I just didn't want to be limited in anything I did so in Photoshop I used the brush tool a lot and I kind of pieced the whole image uh, together over in Photoshop but for creating things like the gauges and uh, all the icons and things that I needed I created those in Illustrator because the shape tools are a lot better over there and you also have the shape builder tool itself uh, so that was a lot easier and a lot quicker to do I just exported those individually and then put them into Photoshop at the end I also did a bit of image editing I added some different lightings and then I added a LUT in there uh, those things that I love to do I talked about in one video how I don't like image editing a lot but I'm trying to get better at it and uh, get more comfortable doing it so I actually kind of enjoy it a little bit almost uh, but I think it actually produced a lot better of an image. It uh, has the more vibrant colors in there. And uh, speaking of the colors, I use the blue as the main highlight color and then the yellow for the gas highlight color. But then there's a nice subtle touch of red in there and that's kind of for like the overheating things, warning the user not to blow your car engine up. Uh, so for the 350Z, I wrote down everything that it had on the original gauges and then I kind of pieced those together on paper and sketched things out where I wanted to uh, put them. Uh, so on the left and the right, I have the main gauges, and then in the center, I have uh, the gear you're in with the time, and then at the top, I have if your uh, engine's cold or hot, and then at the bottom, I have the gas in the center there. So I wanted this design to be like modern and kind of futuristic in a way, so like this car is brand new and you're about to go buy it, or it's about to even come out, and that's kind of what I followed throughout the design, trying to make it uh, that nice, clean HUD as best I could. Uh, so that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the speed art. Make sure you leave a like on this video for more Daily UI. And as always, have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.
Thanks for watching the video guys, be sure to give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. On the left is my previous video, just in case you missed it. On the right is YouTube's recommendation just for you, and the top center icon is my channel icon. Click that to subscribe for more content just like this. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys in the next one.